So anyway, session 27, we're back. Uh, see, last time uh, you guys had been uh, camping out in the dungeon, in the cells in the dungeon of Castle Ravenloft. Um, after taking a short rest there, you made your way into the torture chamber to the west. Uh, in the To the north of that chamber, you spotted a balcony beyond which uh, Esmeralda had indicated the teleporter out of uh, Castle Ravenloft was. But as you approached the balcony, uh, numerous zombies uh, popped out of the water and attacked you guys. Uh, and while you were battling them, you noticed there were also four vampire spawn that joined in the melee. And uh, standing above on the balcony was Rahadin, uh, Strahd's malignant chamber uh, chamberlain. So after fighting off uh, some of the vampire spawn, who seemed to be focusing their attacks on Esmeralda, uh, she heard the voice of Strahd in her head compelling her. Uh, she tried to resist, but was no match for the vampire's will, so she found herself dominated. Uh, she felt a beckoning and, with Rahadin's help, climbed up the balcony and disappeared further into the castle, at which everyone went, No! So you guys desperately tried to come to her aid, but could not get past the waves of Undead and Rahadin himself. Uh, finally, Jugs, having polymorphed into a T-Rex, grabbed the evil Chamberlain in his jaws and hauled him off the balcony. <laughs> Uh, Rowan partitioned the area of combat with a wall of fire, and Adrin managed to get beyond the curtain at the top of the balcony, but uh, by this time, unfortunately, Esmeralda was nowhere to be found. So you turned your attacks on Rahadin himself, and uh, such was your fury that you managed to bring him down, much to your and his surprise. <laughs> uh, the other undead were dealt with shortly after that. Uh, so anyway, beyond the curtain balcony to the north, you found the teleporter that Esmeralda had spoken of. It was an elaborate contraption consisting of a flame, seven magical colored stones, and an hourglass. Unfortunately, you guys had no clear idea of how to operate it. There was a cryptic verse that seemed to give hints as to the possible destinations of the teleporters, uh, and one verse associated the color green with the location where the coffins hide, which you guys took to mean the coffin maker's shop, because uh, you remembered Esmeralda saying that's where she showed up when she used it. So having no other clues, you cast the green stone into the fire, uh, into the fire which turned a green hue itself to match that, and the sand started spilling out through the hour through the hourglass. Uh, so you guys, one at a time, quickly jumped into the fire, including uh, Emil, the guy you'd rescued from the jail cell, and Piddlewick, and you brought the um, skull of Argenvoss with you as well. Clytus kind of lingered behind for a minute. He was reluctant to leave the castle with Esmeralda being held prisoner. Uh, then he heard in his head the evil chuckle of Strahd, and that decided him. He vowed vengeance upon the vampire, and then he too stepped into the green flame and disappeared. And that's where we left off. So, <clears throat> you guys are... Uh, there's this moment of disorientation <coughs> Excuse me. after you step into the flame, and you have this feeling of kind of falling rapidly through a green-colored mist. And then abruptly... You feel solid wood beneath your feet. Uh, you are in darkness, but it's not total. Uh, you can make out squares of illumination that kind of look like windows. Uh, beyond, you see the indirect light of what appears to be some sort of uh, flames, and you hear muted screams, shouts, and other noises coming from beyond the glass. <laughs> um, you guys, actually, most of you have dark vision, so you kind of, uh, after your eyes kind of acclimate to the change in, uh, you stepped right into a flame before, and uh, after your eyes adjust, you can pretty much make out that, yes, you are in the coffin maker shop uh, in Velaki. Uh, everyone made it through. The skull is also with you. That didn't get left behind. Um, but uh, uh, it is nighttime, and there's definitely some sort of ruckus uh, going on outside. You hear all sorts of noises, and um, after a moment, Clytus appears with you as well. Do you mean, Do you outside, mean outside of the of house? house? Mm -hmm. or, or shop? Outside of the shop, yeah, you're actually on the second story. Look outside. Look outside. Is there, I, is there a window? Yes, there are multiple windows, um, and uh, they appear to have uh, they were boarded up uh, last time you were here, but they appear to have been unboarded. And um, looking out them, you see uh, there's mass chaos on the streets of Velaki below. Um, you see townspeople running in all directions, uh, being chased by what look to be wolves and or zombies. <laughs> and you see swarms of what look to be bats swooping around through the streets. It basically looks like mass chaos. 
Let's stay, Let's stay in here. In here. <laughs> <laughs> last, 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 last time we were here, there were four, were four uh, uh, vampire, vampire spawn, spawn up, here. up here. Yes, uh, and you defeated a bunch of them, but um, some of them did escape. For all you know, they actually may have been the same ones. As, some of the ones you may have fought in the uh, in Castle Ravenloft, but. When, when, when we, we look, look around, around, we don't, we don't find, find any. any. <laughs> At the moment, no. You do see the remnants of uh, those crates that they had been in with the dirt from their graves, but um, those don't look like they've moved much at all since you were last here. And you don't see any recent activity apart from, like I said, the boards over the windows had been taken down, which would seem to imply that uh, it wouldn't make as good of a residence for a vampire spawn during the daytime. Although there is no direct sunlight in Barovia, so it doesn't make that much of a difference. But they prefer it to be dark. Should, should uh, uh, maybe, maybe one, one of us try to try get to, get to that, that what's it, what's the, the water, water tap? tap? That's the water, water the, in? Yeah. yeah. The water in is the, um, yeah, that's like, where like the our, our quote-unquote friends, friends there, there, right? right? Um, you can't really see that from this area. Um, where the hell was the coffin maker shop? Yeah. It's down, it's down by the southwest. stockyard. Oh, yeah. southeast. Southeast. Bottom, right? Okay. Yeah. 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 So you, it's hard. You can't really see. You're kind of overlooking actually towards the stockyard itself. So you really can't see too much. But um, can, yeah, can we see, see the, the, uh, the uh, that thing, that thing in the stockyard? Whatever. whatever I forget what, I forget it, was what it was called. But the, the, the thing, the thing that had a tiger, tiger in it. The wagon. The wagon? Uh, yeah, wagon. Yeah, wagon. That's what I'm looking gone. for. Yeah, the wa wagon's long gone. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that was okay. Rictavio's, okay. and uh, he has been missing since you guys um, caused all the ruckus. <laughs> well, we and he, and he, he went, he missing, went missing with his, with wagon. his wagon, mm -hmm. as far as, far as we know. Yep. Does so anybody, anybody got any healing? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I can. We like. We haven't, we haven't rested recently. recently. Right, right. I think I, think I, had, I had. Let me let me look, look at my spells, spells here. here. It shows, it shows I, have I have one first, first level, level and one second, second level, level left. left. So I so can, I can you. heal you. I want to I save, want to some, save town some town folk. folk so um... <clears throat> yeah, I'm just heading out, heading out there and stomping, stomping the first thing I find. Okay. Are you gonna? Okay, so. Um, if you're heading outside, yeah, you're actually on, on the stairway, and from outside, you hear a tremendous kaboom, like a crack of thunder that came from <coughs> Thank you. Thank you. further into the city, not from above. But there was a, a, a great flash that you could see coming, not from above in the sky, but from uh, further back in the more? center of town. Um, I don't want, I don't want to drain, drain, your, drain spells. your spells. It's good, it's good enough, enough for now, I guess. I got 30. I'm, 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 at, I'm at half. Okay. okay. Yeah, when I, I look out the window, window, are there, are there any, any enemies, enemies nearby? nearby? Not, not enemies, enemies, but, but something, something that, looks, that looks like an enemy. Like an enemy. Uh, at the very moment, no, you saw um, about two or three townspeople run across the street from the stockyard mm -hmm. being chased by about two wolves. But they're out of sight. Wolves. So, yeah. So I, so I cannot see anybody, anybody in danger from, from the window. window. Not from the window, no. Cut, cut. But you do hear other cries coming from towards the center of town. So, 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 so how, how, far how far is it across to the, the, the building across the street from us? Can I can I teleport to the roof of the building across the street from us? Uh, yeah, you you um you can see a building within was it like sixty feet is your range I think. Sure, sure. Yeah. Yep. So yes, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that so that I can look. Both, both directions, directions and, and uh, I, don't I, don't know, I want to see what I can see and then yell back to the party what I see. Okay, yeah, you see another building that uh, has a slightly higher roof line not too far away within 60-foot teleport range. So you pop over to there. Uh, you appear on the roof uh, giving you a much better vantage point of the whole town. And uh, you can see, you definitely hear numerous other cries going on. You see um, there's actually a big fire coming from the very center of town, uh, unfortunately right in the direction of the Blue Water Inn. Um, and you see another bright flash come from probably um, right, I don't know, somewhere possibly around here or here. And um, there's another. As, as he teleports, I'm going to 
Yeah. As he, as he teleports, teleports out, I'm gonna, I'm gonna break, break the window, the window and, yell, and yell, "What? What do you what see?" Do you see? Okay. I'm, gonna I'm gonna tell him exactly what I see. I see a big fire near the blue water in. I'm seeing, I'm hearing and seeing explosions near or just south of the blue water in. Um, I. Should we head, Should we that, head way? that way? Yeah, yeah. I, yell I yell out, out I'm, I'm, I'm pissed, pissed because, because we just came straight from Strahd's and, and he kidnapped his Esmeralda, and this is this all is him, him, so I'm just, I'm just, I yelled, I yelled you guys, to you guys, I'm off, I'm off to the Blue Water, water Inn to see, see what I can do, and I just, and I just stomp, stomp down the stairs and okay. start, start going. going. All right, all right, let's go. I'll follow. So you guys head down to the exit of the Coffin Maker shop, and you see... Adrian still on the roof. I'm assuming. Uh, you yeah, can, yeah. If you've got another teleporter, you can pop down to the ground pretty easily. Otherwise, well, well, what I would, what like, I would to like to do actually is, on the, on the way, way, I would, like I would like to teleport, teleport citizens, citizens away from, from danger, danger and put them on the roof of Faso, right? right? Uh, <laughs> they're being, they're being chased, chased by a wolf. I want to be able to help them. Can you do that with your power? Can you teleport others? It just, it just teleport. says teleport. So, so if, if, if it's teleport, teleport, it's only, it's 60, only 60 feet, but theoretically, it can take people. Uh, yeah, but they think you have to be in contact with them. For the right, right. So I would so teleport, I would teleport to, them. to them. Grab, grab them, grab them, them teleport, teleport to the roof. Okay. Um, if, if, it if it comes out, out that's what I want to do. do. Sure. How many times can you use it before you have to? It's, it's, a, it's a bonus, bonus action. As long as, as, long as, as it's dark out, out we're good. We're good. If so it's light out, I'm screwed. So there's no limitation on usage in terms of the number of times you can do this? Nope, nope. There is no limitation on usage. It has to be dim or dark. Okay, yeah, it's definitely dim and dark. It's pretty dark out, actually. Okay, so, uh, yeah, as you're going along, um, uh, running towards the center of town, I'm, I'm assuming you're taking, are you taking the main road or trying to stay behind buildings, or how are you guys proceeding, besides Adrian, who's popping up and down all over the place? I'm, 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 I'm following, I'm following this, the, the, the lead, the lead, of, lead the of the main party, party group. group. That's, That's what I'm doing, doing. As, we as we go. I'm going to try, I'm gonna to, try go to go as, as straight, straight as, as possible to, to the Blue Water, the Blue Water Inn. Inn. Okay. Meaning, Meaning going, going between, between buildings, buildings and such, and such not, not going on the main roads necessarily. necessarily. Okay. But if I, but if, I, if, I if I see people people threatened or monsters, or monsters I'm just going to wade, wade into them and start, them and start hacking. hacking. Okay. Yeah. Um. I'm not going to go round by round to this because you guys have gotten to the point where you know just doing a combat with like wolves and zombies is just going to be kind of laborious at this point, and you, it's not like a serious threat to you, but it it will kind of draw on your resources, so. Um, yeah, to make a uh, long story short, you make your way towards the center of town. Uh, there are, you do spot people being chased uh, by wolves or by zombies, and uh, Adrian, you manage to teleport in and pop some of them to safety. Uh, the rest of you guys kind of intercede as necessary to save people. Uh, you do, at one point, uh, as you get to probably about here, um, you do spot down, this, uh, down that side street going to the north. Um, there, you see the two um, wolf hunters that you uh, first met when you first got to Velaki, the, the guys that offered their services. Uh, they are actually standing in, in, a, in the center of a circle of wolves uh, who are kind of basically moving in towards them, but it looks like they're managing to hold their own to hold them off. I would probably yeah, throw, yeah, throw some yeah, fireballs that, fire that, fire that way, airballs, yeah, bolts, that that way. Uh, so you guys step in um, after some exchange of uh, firebolts and other uh, combat. Uh, you manage to slay the wolves and uh, get. They manage to break free of this ring of wolves, um, and uh, they see you and um, shout their thanks and say, "What the hell is going on around here?" We have, we no, have idea. no idea. <laughs> Don't tell us. We, we just got, got back. back. Yeah, I, we just came in from one of the north gate and. There's just wolves everywhere. What's going on? We don't, we know. don't know. We just, we teleported, just teleported from Strahd's castle. castle. That, 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 that might, might be the reason. reason. <laughs> <laughs> they look at each other and... Yeah, probably so. Anyway, let's go to see if we can get to the center of town. Looks like the uh, Blue Water Inn might be on fire. Yeah, yeah, so yeah let's get over there. Okay, so they uh, join you and uh, they assist in you kind of wading through this uh, confusion, confusing mass. Um, as you get to the uh, center of town, uh, you do see that the Blue Water Inn is definitely on fire. And uh, as you reach that in main intersection, uh, you happen to see another flash come from the road to the south. And another 
blast of thunder, and uh, you see standing in the middle of the street, probably about, oh, I don't know, maybe f three, four hundred uh, feet to the south, uh, there's a lone figure standing in the middle of the street. Uh, he is, or she, you can't really tell from this distance, is surrounded by wolves as well, and um, looks like they're closing in. Rescue. Rescue. Uh, rescue time. time. Okay, I'm going to create, create water, water above the, the water in. It says, uh, I'll just, I'll cast, just cast it here. It here. Uh, I, I, didn't I didn't have that one selected. selected. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't have, have that prepared. one prepared. So are you guys going to help with the Blue Water Inn, or are you going to go to the assistance of this figure? Let's go, Let's rescue, go rescue the figure first, because yeah. it can help yeah. us with the inn. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Uh, yeah, you head down towards uh, running down the street, and um, you see uh, yet, uh, as you approach, another blast of um, of light and another thunderclap. And actually, you can t see that this figure... Was they cast a lightning bolt spell and took down two more wolves, um, but now it looks like whoever it is might be out of spells, and the wolves are just about to jump on them. All right, all right. Oh, let's yeah. rescue. Res rescue. Come <laughs> combat. Okay. Um, yeah. Again, I, I'm not going to belabor this into combat because uh, again, I think you guys oh, oh. can hold your own. Um, but uh, you get close enough to see that it is actually Victor. The um, <coughs> Burgomaster's son, or actually the Burgomaster now. <laughs> yeah, 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 okay. Yeah. okay. And um, there are about six wolves around him biting and snapping. Uh, you guys jump into combat, and um, that uh, you manage to fight off the rest of the wolves, uh, and there's also some zombies that are starting to creep in. And uh, after taking care of the uh, zombies, uh, Victor looks at you, and then he kind of does a double take, and he says, You! What are you doing back in town? What the hell is going, going on here? I have no idea. I was perusing my spell book and suddenly all hell broke loose. Alright, alright. Well, well, blue water, blue water ends, ends on fire. fire. Let's, Let's go try to, try to make sure make everyone's, everyone's okay. okay. Wait, no, we have to we save my Tom, we, can... we have to save my spell book first. And he um, starts running towards his uh, the Burgomaster's mansion. Uh, well, well, I can, I can, I'll, I'll go, go with him. him. I'm, I'm going, going to the Blue Water, water Inn. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, he doesn't even look back. He keeps on running. Uh, Jugs, you go back to the Blue Water Inn. Uh, Adrian, are you going after Victor, or are you going after... Well, well let's, let's think, think about this. Uh, uh, do I care about, about a spell book? book? Or people? Or people. I'll, I'll vote for the people. people. Screw, Screw it. it. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's where I'm at. I agree. Okay. Everybody, uh, gets, everybody one. gets one. Yeah, you guys kind of look at each, other, at each other, kind of shrug. <laughs> All right, whatever. <laughs> Let him head off on his own, and uh, you guys head up to the Blue Water Inn, which is now definitely a, a blaze. And um, you uh, see the Mardikovs, um, uh, except for one of the children outside. And um, they see you and recognize you immediately and uh, say, can you save Bray? He's trapped up there. I teleport, I teleport to whatever window they tell me to. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, you guys actually remember the children's room. You actually kind of hid in there at one point when yep. uh, yeah, 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 right. mm -hmm. first through. So you know exactly which room uh, he's in, and it is definitely trapped in there. Um, go, Adrian. go, Adrian. So, Adrian, yeah, you're able to see the room that is the children's room looks like it's it just about engulfed in flames um so it definitely would be risky you teleporting in there how many hit points do you have i'm doing, I'm it, doing anyway. it anyway i don't care i'm going i'm in. going in okay uh so you teleport into the midst of a roaring inferno uh so yep. you yep. would need to make a constitution saving throw constitution not dexterity, not dexterity? uh well no the whole room's on fire and <laughs> okay. okay it's more of a you just jumped into the fire literally Okay, um, so you are going to take, uh, actually, I'll just do it in chat. Hang on here. Uh, you take half of that. Oh. You take half of that. So, nine. So, so ten? Or, or eight, eight. Nine. Nine. Yeah. 
Um, but you, you yep. see yep. Um, the boy, Bray Martikov, uh, laying unconscious. It looks like a beam from above, a raptor, a raptor, or not a raptor, a raptor from above uh, fell on him. It looks like it at least knocked him unconscious. Uh, you're not sure, though, if he's breathing. And it looks I, like I grab him, and, and I, I don't know, it's, I don't not, know, that it's that not that high. high. I can, I can, I can fall, fall if I want. If I want. It doesn't matter. So fall. fall. Okay. I can fall, I can fall, fall 40, 40 feet. Uh, but uh, I'm going to get, gonna the, get the hell out of there. Grab him, grab him, go. If you jump out the window, uh, you he would take the damage as well as you. Oh, oh then I wouldn't tell. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was wondering if there was any reason why you wouldn't do that. Uh, yep, so, yep. yep, teleporting then. Okay, you grab him and poof, appear uh, as a smoking <laughs> figure back on the uh, on the lawn and um, they quickly grab him and um, it looks like he's in pretty dire straits. Can somebody, somebody heal him? Is he... Is he... D- d- I, 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 I give, give a cantrip, cantrip spare, spare the dying. dying. Is, is he at zero, at zero hit, hit points, or? or it it doesn't look like he's breathing. Okay, okay, I will, I will do that, do that quick. quick. Okay, it, it, and it says, uh, it says it's, let me let just, me just uh, put, it put it in the, in the chat. chat. Oh, okay. Okay. Yep. So. Uh, as you touch him, the power of Lathander courses through you, and uh, you see he uh, doesn't wake up, but he does uh, kind of choke a little Stabilize. bit, Stabilize. And cough, and start to breathe. So uh, the Mardikovs are extremely grateful. Um, meanwhile, the inn is uh, now blazing. Uh, it definitely is caught, moved on from the sta- to the stables as well. Um, there's now kind of a bucket brigade kind of forming, but it's uh, having a real tough time keeping up with this blaze. And meanwhile, other undead and wolves are still running about. I, I, I'm going right. to go, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go now, and I'm going to start rescuing other people throughout town. town. That's, That's it. That's all I'm going to do. Okay. <laughs> well, what if I and I'll, and do, I'll do my best, best to help keep, keep the inn in from, from uh, burning, burning, because this is a, is a place, place where we can... Where we can Take refuge. Take refuge. And drink. And drink. <laughs> uh, that, that's, that's less important, important than having a central, central point, point, point from which we can. I mean, does I mean, this thing, thing look like it's gone, gone or, or does it look like, like we can still save it? Still save it? Uh, it may partially be salvageable, but it's hard to tell because there's so much flame at the moment and smoke. Uh, I'm going to pray, pray to my to god, god and, and see, see if he will grant, grant me the ability to. To create, to create water, water over this, this, this flame, flame or this, or this building, building by the, by the graciousness, graciousness of him, even, even though I didn't prepare, prepare it this morning. This morning. I, still I still have a spell, spell slot, so it's, so it's kind of up to, up to uh, uh, Lathander, Lathander to see if this, see if this will, help. will help. I try. I try. Okay, you reach out, petitioning to your deity and God, and you hear Strahd's voice in your head laughing at you. <laughs> well, ain't, well, that, ain't quaint. that quaint? Unfortunately, you are not granted an additional spell. Um, speaking of which, um, you guys, um, as you're putting out the flames and the fire and helping with the bucket brigade, um, there's kind of a whoosh, and right through the center of town, you see Strahd's carriage. Actually, you recognize it just going like a bat out of hell right through the basically right past the blue water inn and charging down towards the west gate the sunset gate Strods? Strods? yes carriage carriage oh man oh man i'm going, I'm going after it okay on foot <laughs> i'll follow, I'll follow the, the dwarf. dwarf uh you are actually not there you've been teleporting around oh it's right oh, it's right uh, you that's right, that's right. Not see it um but the others do spot it um but it is moving fast like faster, okay. Okay. faster than a horse at a gallop. Uh, well, I'm going well, to do what I can to keep up with it. Okay, uh, you go charging after it, and um, if I if see I a see horse, a horse, I will, I will commandeer, commandeer it. it. Well, uh, it's well ahead of you at this point. So uh, right. yeah, you're not you're definitely not going to catch up with it on foot. You can tell that much. All right, All right, I, look I look for a horse, a horse or, something or something that I can. Borrow. borrow. Um, nothing is in the immediate vicinity. There may be. Do some I, see, do I see where it's going? going? You, it's yeah. It charged past you and is heading towards the west end of town. And is right, I, think I think it's going to the, going church. To the church. So I'm so going, I'm going over, there. over there. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make my way for Saint Andrew's Church. Okay. Yeah, yeah. 
Um, I'll, yeah, I'll follow. All right, so you guys follow again. It, it the the carriage basically gets lost to the darkness and smoke um, after a while because sure, you guys sure. are running on foot. But you head towards the church. The zombies uh, actually seem to increase in number the closer you get to the church. And uh, in fact, as you approach the church, you can see that it looks like they may be coming out of the graveyard behind the church. Not great. Question, question, question for you. For you. What happened, what happened to that, to that guy, guy we saved, saved and, and Piddlewick? Piddlewick. Um, yeah, I was actually going to get to that. Um, Emil so- seems to have gotten lost in the confusion. Um, Piddlewick, um, you look back and he's like running after you guys <laughs> down the main street on his old stubby legs, but uh, he's not able uh, to uh, keep, catch up with him. But he definitely is very distinctive in his movements. So you can, can, I, can I pick, him, pick up him up and carry, carry him? him? Uh, yeah, to, to sure. You could run back there and scoop him up and do kind of a piggyback thing. He's actually surprisingly well. No, he, he actually is fairly dense, um, but he's not like so heavy that you can't carry him on your shoulders. Uh, he weighs. Yeah, uh, yeah. You can tell I'll give him, I'll give him like a piggyback, piggyback ride. ride. Okay, yeah, he kind of claps his hands. <laughs> Master Blaster <laughs> runs down the main track towards the church. Um, it's probably, anyway, probably like having a ten year, ten year old, old on, your, on back. your back, right? Right. Yeah, yeah he's a little smaller yeah, I mean, than a halfling, but uh, he's very dense. He's much denser than a normal child would be. I am. A, I am a half orc, so. so yeah. So yeah, so this that half orc carrying this uh, weird jester-looking construct. Who, it's got to look, gotta look pretty amusing. amusing. <laughs> yes, it's a, not something you see every day in uh, Velaki, much less Barovia. Uh, anyway, you guys uh, get to the church. Uh, apart from the fact that. There, the zombies seem to be crawling out of the graves in the back. Um, the church itself, you notice, is very uh, is all blackened, uh, like it too suffered a fire, but not recently. It, you don't see smoke or uh, any signs of recent fire. But uh, okay. the, the doors, you notice, are are basically gone. The front doors are gone, and the church itself looks like it's deserted. Do we see, Do we the, see the, the cart, cart or wagon, or, wagon or, whatever. or whatever? Um, oh, Strahd's carriage? Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. No, nowhere in the vicinity. You don't see them. Okay. 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 Uh, you do uh, see we... um, from your well, it's those of you dark vision can make out. It looks like the uh, sunset gate is wide open. Well, we're well, not we're not going to catch Strahd, but, but I want to go into St. Andrew's, Andrew's Church because the last time we knew. Uh, what's, her uh, what's her name, her name was in here, here and we know yeah, she's not, not so, so we'll see what's going on in the church. In the church. A, good, a, good a good friend of ours used to be, used to be here, so... so. <laughs> uh, yeah, inside the church itself, um, you don't see any kind of desecration or anything, uh, but it definitely looks like someone set fire to the place, and um, like the there's scorch marks on the pews and... Um, it, it looks like there was a fire in here that was then later contained. The front doors look like they're s- basically laying in pieces on the floor, like they were smashed open from outside. Okay. Uh, no sign of any people that you can find. Uh, although you do remember that there was like a secret alcove under the um, altar. And um, uh, sure enough, hiding in there, you find uh, Yeska, who was the altar boy. And uh, okay, he okay. apparently took refuge there just recently today once all this chaos started going on. And he says that um, while he, he actually wasn't in the church at the time, but uh, just like within the last, right around the time you guys, shortly before you guys teleported, it seems like, um, there was some sort of an attack, at a simultaneous attack at all three gates. Uh, the guards were overwhelmed, and the gates were thrown open, and then all of these wolves just poured into the town. And at the same time, the corpses in the church uh, graveyard started clawing their way out of the ground and wreaking havoc in the town. And uh, he hid in the one safe place that he knew of in, in this alcove. The <coughs> where's where's, where's Arena? Uh, that, his face kind of darkens, and uh, he says that... Um, she was taken from the church about two days ago. They, she was in the middle of giving a service when the front doors were just blown open off their hand, off their hinges. Uh, not from like an explosion or anything, just just by pure force. It seemed like, uh, and there were these two old women who came in, and um, Arena 
got up in their face <sighs> telling them to leave and they did something to kind of enchant them enchant her and so she became really docile and she followed them out and you know who you know who those were yeah, yeah. The hags. The hags. His description good, good pretty much matches that of uh, Morgantha and her, her sole surviving daughter. Which makes sense a little bit because you know, as far as you know, the church is actually still consecrated and vampires couldn't enter it or undead right. couldn't right. actually enter it. Which is why Yeska still felt safe hiding there. But uh, the hags seem to be under no uh, restriction whatsoever. They just walked right in and took Irina. Some fucking hags. fucking hags. Oh, oh God. God. So they, they uh, suck. Um, yep. I guess uh, making a long story short, uh, you guys get Yeska to safety, and uh, you, you manage to help put out the fire at the Blue Water Inn. Uh, get the zombies and the wolves under control, um, and uh, that's pretty much all you learn uh, at, up to this point as to what happened. You're not sure why it happened, uh, although. The timing with your confrontation with Strahd and his minions uh, seems to be pretty coincidental. I'm going to go I'm gonna back, go back to the coffin maker shop, shop and, and double, double check, check that the dragon's head is still there. Uh, yes, you left it there and there it remains. Okay. okay. Can we, can find, we a find a wagon, wagon and a horse, a horse and, and wagon in town, town and um, rent, well, rent, rent, rent it? Rent it. Uh, yeah, the, the the Blue Water Inn is not a complete loss, but the stables are definitely burned up. Um, it, there's going to be a huge amount of repair that needs to be done. Um, and the Mardikovs, unfortunately, the, I mean, it's it's not inhabitable as it currently stands. But um, the uh, Airsec Stockyard, excuse me, uh, for your assistance in uh, battling the, to- uh, the Blaze and assisting the townspeople and everything, they'd be more than happy to... Um, let you guys take a wagon and would, at no charge, uh, and horses to ride. What is, what is uh, uh, the Markov's name? name? Um, I forget, his, I forget name. his name. Davian is the old one. Um, no, no. The Irwin. So Irwin is his name. Irwin. Irwin. I'm gonna walk, I'm gonna walk up to Irwin, up to Irwin and, uh, and uh, tell him tell I'm sorry, sorry for his loss, loss and, and, and hand him fifty platinum, platinum pieces. pieces. Okay, uh, he yeah. just kind of looks aghast and he says you realize I could not take your money you've already done so much uh, for this family you have a you lot, have of, lot work of work to do to, to bring, bring this back, back up to the way, to the way it, used it used to be well I my family and I pride ourselves in our hard work um, I I don't know what to say but I understand the ge- the generosity with which this is offered so I will consider it a loan for now You've helped, You've helped us immensely, us immensely so, so the least, the least I, can I can do. Well, I thank you again. Uh, you are always welcome at the Blue Water Inn and any Vardikov residence. Well, 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 then I, I that one, that one chip in too. I'm going to follow, I'm follow the, 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 the back. <laughs> I'm going I'm to hand him a uh, uh, hundred platinum pieces. Jeez. <laughs> I don't, I don't use it. I don't care. You guys can like. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I have yet I have, I have to buy anything. Right. Right. In this, in this campaign. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. have over 110 platinum, and I'm, and I'm like, like, okay, what am I ever gonna do with this? So I'm gonna give it to him. He needs it more than I do. Yeah. He gets 100 platinum. Did you guys find that in the castle? I can't. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah. I give him. I give him 50 as well. Okay. So you guys have suddenly you're just rolling in jank and. I don't. I don't. You I have, have to, to rebuild roll, roll coin, coin with nothing to do with it. I have to, I have to rebuild, rebuild a church, church so that's uh, what that's what I plan on doing with my. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. So you, you realize that the amount of money you just dumped in his lap, he could buy all of the locky with, pretty much. Well, well, that's <laughs> good. I hope he does. Let him. Yeah, I like him. He can he can run the town. Uh, well, yeah. He well, you haven't unless you say that to him. He doesn't. Doesn't look like he's ready to run for mayor just yet. Speaking of mayor, uh, burgomaster. Uh, his uh, spell book turned up safe and sound. Nobody bothered to start a fire at the Burgomaster's mansion. So uh, he was very relieved about that. And uh, he thanks you for saving his life. And then then he goes around and starts questioning all the guards and finding out who was on duty when this happened. Um, unfortunately, all those that were on duty are already dead, so he's not able to punish them. But... 
you, you can, you kick, can them. kick them. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah not even much left of their bodies. They've been pretty much chewed over by either the wolves or the right. zombies. <laughs> the zombies. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, in any case, a uh, long night passes. Uh, you guys are, well, you can't sleep at the Blue Water Inn. Uh, you could spend in the, either at the church, the ruins of the church. I, I shouldn't say ruins, but the, the abandoned church. Or, yeah, yeah, I think uh, that's a... Uh, let's let's bring, bring the, the dragon's, dragon's head, head to the church and then, and then sleep there. there. Okay, yeah, you kind of surmise again that the... And uh, Rowan, you can kind of confer that, confirm that the place does still have... Uh, it has been sanctified, so... Sure, sure, uh, okay, okay. I feel relatively safe there, at least from undead, and uh, if not everything. Uh, you're mani you managed to kind of put the wall, or the, put the doors back up and kind of reinforce them with the remnants of some pews and so forth to kind of barricade yourselves in. So, you're able to take a long rest. Yay! Good, good. I need, I need it. Yes. So when, so I when, I when I wake up in the morning, I'm going to go out and hand gold pieces out to any any dirty-looking dirty kid. And I'm going to hand out 25 more gold. Okay. Um, so you walk the streets like, um, I don't know, kind of a re Robin Hood or some sort, and just start uh, handing out money like candy to passersby, yep, yep. and they're just kind of all in dodge <laughs> staring at you, and... They kind of look at you a bit distrustful. They're like, okay, why is this guy just showering money around and uh, making like, this what, is what it is, man. Such a blazing beacon of, hey, rob me. <laughs> <laughs> at least that's only, only, only if you can catch me. Can catch me. Yeah, right, right. nobody that, that you give money to looks like they're going to try and rob you of any sort, but they, they do kind of look at you with, uh, like, they're not sure what to make of you. It's like, this guy is either really this tough guy, this guy's local. or really delusional. <laughs> 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 but uh, they just don't know how to deal with kindness like this. Uh, nobody has... It's very rare to see an act of kindness in Barovia. Well, uh, well, then I say, what, is it, is it pass it on, on or pay, 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 pay forward? Pay forward, pay forward man. <laughs> <laughs> they, um, yeah, it, it, that, you definitely bring some brightness to their otherwise completely dreary lives so uh what about the rest of you guys uh what are you going to do for the time being you've got this dragon skull you've got this dragon skull in the center of the church but otherwise uh, you still haven't figured out what happened to emil he just kind of vanished, vanished. Into chaos. yeah can we can uh, we uh go go drop, drop, drop this skull off you guys, off you guys? Head down. Head down. Uh, in Vostold? Vostold? Yeah. yeah. I think we, I think should. we should. Well, we, well, we, need, a we need a wagon or something. because we, we, we got one. one. Oh, oh. Uh -huh. okay. Yes, the uh, air sex stockyard was more than happy to uh -huh. provide one for you. So you've got a wagon uh, and a horse to draw it. So uh, if you wish... We bought, we bought one for the 200 platinum pieces. pieces. We just handed it out. Over yeah, that was an expensive <laughs> wagon. <laughs> But uh, that, that was before, actually, you started throwing money out like candy. But <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so if you wish to uh, head towards Argenvost, uh, it's basically first light, so you would be able to reach there in very little time. Yeah, yeah. let's do, let's that. do that. Yeah, let's, yeah, do, let's that. do that. Drop, drop off the, the skull. Let's actually complete something, complete something we set out to do. Okay. <laughs> what do you mean? What a crazy, crazy idea. idea. <laughs> Whatever, Whatever. If you guys say we're completing something, something I'm, all, I'm, all, I'm against it. <laughs> no, no way. way. We, we, haven't we haven't completed, completed anything yet. yet. Why would we start now? now? Yep. Yep. <laughs> <clears throat> So, um, in any case, the uh, remnants of the guard um, allow you to, to uh, exit Flocky uh, to the west. Um, and, yeah, you um, make your way towards Kresk. Um, I'm assuming you're taking the most direct route. Uh, what the hell happened yeah, to yeah. the map of Barovia? Oh, yeah. So yeah, it's the uh, again, Argonvost isn't Argonvost Holt isn't that far, um, so it should only take you probably a couple hours of wandering your way through the forest. Um, see if anything costs you along the way. 
No, looks like uh, everyone's pretty pooped out after that recent activity. So uh, you managed to make your way up and approach the uh, haunted house on the hill. Uh, how do you plan to approach the mansion? Directly, Directly I guess. I mean, <laughs> just roll up into the front yard? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, because we're, we're going. We have to, we have bring, to bring the skull, the skull probably, probably to, to his, his grave. grave I'm assuming. Where we, where we had to take it. Yeah, yeah. Where we, where had, where to we had to take it now. There was there a, was a that, that thing, outside thing outside where where uh, the. I thought. I thought. What do you mean? What do you mean? There was the mausoleum. Yeah. 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 Okay. 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 Yeah, yeah. Right. So, so uh, bring it, bring it there. The... Oh shoot! Yeah, the, yeah, the, the only, only question, question I have is, okay, okay, he knows, he knows this thing, this thing is, thing gone, is gone, and he probably, probably knows, knows where we're, we're taking it. So, it, so. is he can, is he can try, try to fend, us, fend off us off on the on way? The way. Or while, or while we're there, there you know. He, he could have could tried, tried to take it from the, the coffin, coffin maker shop, shop while, while we were busy, busy fighting his minions, if you really, really wanted to. to. Yeah, yeah, true. That is true. Yep, yep. We, uh, we uh, on, the on the way here, we didn't see any sign, sign of, of um, uh, uh, his, his, his cart, cart or wagon. Or wagon. Uh, did we, did we... No. Um, if you ask around, though, uh, someone who uh, just got into town said that uh, he was actually en route uh, the night before, um, being an insane sort of fellow traveling at night, and he actually got off the road and it was uh, it rushed past him. Uh, he was actually traveling from Kresk, the village of Kresk. Okay. 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 I wonder if he's headed up there to see the monk, monk, whatever that guy's called, the abbot. Anyway, anyway, I think we're just going to roll up to Argon Boss Tolt. Okay. And something happens, something happens. Otherwise, we're going to take it to the bath, I assume. Right, right. All right, so I'm just going to bring you guys to that map then. Uh, again, Argonvost, hold. Uh, I'm putting you on the front, the main layer, which is the second lower half. And never mind that black splotch there. That's actually was something I goofed up on, and I haven't been able to delete it for some reason. <laughs> Okay. The mask that I was starting to draw and couldn't delete. So we're so going to be in a courtyard, courtyard again? Uh, yeah, so if you pull up uh, to the front uh, near the dragon statue that uh, kind of puffed out a little bit of frost last time you were here. Yeah. yeah. What's, What's that, that horse, horse and... Cart. cart. Oh, uh, see that? that was actually from before, but we'll say that's your cart, horse and cart now. Okay. 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 Where's the mausoleum part again? Uh, the mausoleum. Some, some... Yeah, was in the back, back by the graveyard. So we're, so we're gonna take the skull, the skull and walk yeah, on yeah. through. It's like, it's like over here. here. Why don't we? Why don't we... Or we, or could, we ride, could ride, take that take that cart, cart all the way all back, the way back there. there, couldn't we? Uh, well, there's, well, there's a fence. Yeah, there's a fence, and the ground is fairly uneven here. It would be tough to get a cart over. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. But you could, yeah. I just, I'm just curious what direction or what route you're taking to the mausoleum. Should we go, Should we right, go right through? through? We'll go in there. Yeah. yeah. And then, do, and then we do we see anything, we'll anything when we get in there? there? Um, if you proceed inside, um, no, it looks like that the, um, mansion is about the same state that you left it. Um, okay. but, um, and again, unfortunately I've covered this area, which I didn't want to do, but, uh, in the area, in this area right here is where the church was. 
Yeah. Yeah. And um, looking out over the churchyard, you actually spot. Um, in the backyard, all of the revenants standing guard at the mausoleum. Of course we, of course do. we do. Well, it's well, not, it's not necessarily, necessarily a bad, bad thing. thing. Yeah, yeah. I think, I think we should we try, should to, try carry to carry out the skull. Out the skull. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 I agree. agree. Yep, yep. Just, Just come out, come out you know, here, here and, and walk, walk down, down and say, tell, hey, tell hey. them we brought, brought Argon Boss. Boss. To his, to his resting place. place. Okay, so you're just basically going to walk out the front or the back steps here into the courtyard and carrying the skull. Okay. Ow, ow. Uh, why don't you guys yeah, go yeah. ahead and arrange yourselves in the order you're going to be in when you emerge? Okay. Mm -hmm. Clytus, Clytus might want to adjust your hit points. Yep, yep. Hang on, I'm zoomed. There we go. Yeah, so who's yeah, so carrying the skull, skull with me? I think, I think all four of us should. should. I, I, I assumed it was just kind of two of us. Okay, okay I, will. I will. Well, okay. yeah, two of you could carry it, but it is still several hundred pounds, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah but we had a nice... Quiet, quiet ride, ride on the way over. over. It's, it's not like we've had to carry it yeah. far. <laughs> he had a rest. So, yeah, as you emerge with the skull, um, you see definitely one of the um, revenants uh, is kind of... I'm not going to say you recognize him because he's occupying a new corpse, but uh, one of them is definitely Vladimir Horngard, who's the leader of the revenants. Yeah, yeah. Um, and one of them you recognize mm -hmm. from before because you didn't kill him, uh, Sir Godfrey Willem. Um, he's there as well, uh, and if you remember that pretty much the revenants all have to do as Vladimir commands because it's really his will that's keeping them alive or keeping them undead, I should say. Well, he's, well, the, he's one the one who attacked us twice, twice thus far. Right, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, and he sees you coming and carrying uh, this dragon's giant dragon skull, and um, he immediately lets out this blood-curdling shriek, and he says, Defilers! Defilers! Oh, Destroy not, them not, all! Not, not, no, no, not, not defilers. No, no, no. Bring, yes, bring the bones yes. back. Try, try, to, try, to, try, to, try to put them to rest. them rest. Uh, that's, that's why we're going to out Parley. Parley. <laughs> I don't think Parley's going to work. Live <laughs> <laughs> a, a fucking, fucking bitch. bitch. I mean, I, I mean, don't I don't know what you expected, expected to, happen, to happen, but that's about what I expected. <laughs> he's pretty predictable along those lines, and he's insane too. That doesn't help. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. <sighs> Save, save us! us. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, excuse me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get, go some, get water some water before, before we start, we start here. here. Okay. I'll, do, I'll do the same. Did I not start fantasy girls? Okay, that was just dumb. No, I forgot something. So while that's loading. Oh, you suck.
Damn, damn it. Isn't this, Isn't this guy tired of, tired of us kicking, kicking his butt? His butt? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't know how well that's going to go with all these freaking remnants there. <clears throat> yeah, but yeah, but then there are his buddies. Well, who's who's controlling Fiddleweight? Oh yeah, I don't know. I'll just control him. <clears throat> his buddies <clears throat> listened to us last time, but if he controls them. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't think, think they're, they're going to listen. Yeah, they pretty much have. From what you remember, uh, he pretty much says, uh, Sir Godfrey said that they had to do whatever he said. So, <laughs> All right. Um, all right, well, it looks like um, Dave's gone, but he's not up first anyway. So I'm going to go ahead and start. So it looks like the first... Uh, Three of the revenants are going to get a chance to do something first, and they've got. Do they have any ranged weapons? No, not really. They just have long swords. So, uh, assuming that you go ahead and drop the skull, <laughs> be careful not to shatter it. Um, and which one is? That? All right, he's the one way at the back. Okay, so he's just going to five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty. He's just gonna double move up to there, having to climb over the fence. This guy is already over the fence, so he's going to dash. He runs up to there, and this guy runs up to there. So we're up to Adrian. Okay, okay. I activate my magic sword with full, with full power. power. Okay. So, so everybody within 30 feet of me gets an additional 1d4 radiant damage against hostile creatures. Yeah. Um, guess I will attack. Great. Okie dokie. Jesus. Wow. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Which one are you attacking? Um, I guess I the guess one, the one at the uh, top, top of the stairwell there. there. So, so, did you, get, you, get, you see that? Number three? Revenant three? I can't, I can't see, see a number, number oh, okay, so... Sorry. Okay, here. So, do you get, do you get that 1d4 radiant, radiant as well? Or... Oh, yep. Oh. yep. Yep. Is, yep. That, is that like uh, like always in, in that's that, that track, sword yeah. for you? I, 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 went I went ahead and added it to the the, 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 the configuration of it. Of it. Oh, nice. oh, nice. So, so 14, uh, 23, 25, and but six, but six of that is radiant. I think, I we, think need we need those, those the ancestor, ancestor swirling, swirling, swirling guys. guys. <laughs> ancestor swirling. What, what is yes, it? We do. Yeah, yeah. Spirit, spirit guardian. There, there you go. go. <laughs> uh, it's, well, it's Jugs' his turn, so. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna my, do favorite my favorite thing. thing. And I'm, I'm I don't know, I don't where, know I'm where I'm supposed, supposed to stand. stand. I'm, gonna I'm gonna stand, stand right there. there. I'm going to haste both, both of them. them. Is, that Is that appropriate in front of all these revenants? revenants? <laughs> <laughs> uh, who are you hasting? Uh, uh, Adrian and Clytus. Okay. Ooh. <clears throat> Did you? T I assume you twinned it. Yep, yep. Okay, so you two are hasted. So, so who, who did you haste? You two. You, two. you, and, you and Adrian. Adrian. Okay. okay. All right. Thank, Thank you. you. Um, yep, yep. Yeah. Um, I'm going to call for a wild surge on you, actually. Oh, no. Just because it's been a while. <laughs> it's, uh, it's all right. fun and games <laughs> until someone calls a wild. Yes, I know. <laughs> wait till, wait till there's a firebolt centered, centered on me. On me. Okay. You always seem to benefit from these things. I don't know why I'm doing this, but. 71. 71. Uh, where is the wild? Ah! Oh, Jesus. 
What is it? What is it? Immune, Immune to all damage. damage. <laughs> no. Oh, Resistance <laughs> to all damage. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> I do not Perfect. Perfect. The game so resistance to all damage for yeah, the next yeah. minute. <laughs> okay. You have yet to have a wild surge do anything but benefit you. I know. I know. Well, well, well one time it aged, aged me, I guess. I, guess. I don't know, I don't know if that's a benefit or a, or a bad, bad thing. Certainly not worth the... Oh, well. It's not been very uh, detrimental effect, we'll say that. It's not, it's not been very fun, fun for the DMs, what you're saying. No, exactly. <laughs> I want you to sprout like a 15-foot schlong or something like that. Uh, anyway, uh, on to uh, Revenant number two is going to... 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. He's going to dash up to here. And that's all I can do. Sir Godfrey, um, he's going to kind of approach half half, uh, half heartedly, but not dash. <coughs> he's obeying, but only because he has to. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. This guy is going to run up. And this guy is going to climb the fence and. Right there. So, Cletus. Uh, uh, in in just a second. That's, 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 uh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm hasted, hasted so, so that gives me, gives me one, one action, action on top of, on top of everything, everything else, or what does that do? One action. One action. Well, so, so it's in the chat yeah, there. Yeah, it's in the chat. It basically, you get okay, your speed okay. is doubled. You get a bonus sure, for your sure. uh, Basically, you can you do it. You get an action which can only be used to take the attack, dash, disengage, hide, or use an object action. So I, so could, I cast could cast a spell, a spell move, move, and attack, and attack normal. normally. Yep. 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 Yes. 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 You just you just can't okay. cast. Okay. Then I'm gonna, then I'm gonna cast aid. aid. Right. Right. So I'm, so I'm gonna, gonna go ahead and cast aid. aid. Okay. Um, so, all um, so all you guys get five points, points on top of, on top of your normal hit points for eight hours. Eight hours. <clears throat> and then, and I'm, gonna then I'm gonna walk up and hit hit this guy. This guy. Okay. So, so let's, let's see. see. Yeah, there is. Feel free to radiant damage. Yep. 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 Oh yeah. Yeah, these guys have really low AC. Okay. So both hit. Yes. Both hit. Nice. 28 plus, plus 2d4. Radiant. Radiant. Yep, yep. Damn, damn. So, 34. 30, 34. Okay, yeah. You put that up, up to two targets, targets within five, five feet. We've never, We've never figured, figured out why that's, why that's coded, coded in, there. in there. It's, it's not, supposed not supposed to be in there. there. Yeah, I'm not. Okay, okay. It was from. It was from it's, it's, it's 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 his sword. His sword. It's, the it's the revenant sword. sword. Right. The main the main guy. guy. Oh. So, so is, is there any description with him, with him of what that, that meant? Yeah, it's is it part, is of, it part of his description? description. I don't know how it managed to get translated like that, but it's basically um, basically it's a sword that is, is helpful against Strahd. Okay. Okay. It, okay. it basically has no bearing unless it's you're attacking Strahd. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. Well, well, I still, I hit, still him hit him hard. Yes, you hit him very hard. Um, <laughs> he kind of rocks back on his feet. Uh, Rowan's up. Okay. Okay. I am, I am going, going to, to first. First. Oh, I forgot to add Pillowick. Cash, cash the. the uh, that's right. He's at one. <laughs> Spirit, Spirit guardians, guardians, like he was, he was asking. <laughs> so I did, so have, I did a have a question, because I was looking, I was looking through my spells before, before Clytus cast, cast aid. aid. If, if I, I cast aid, aid does, does that stack? stack? No. no. Okay, okay. I didn't, I didn't think so. Think no, so. Nothing, nothing ever stacks. stacks. Okay. okay. That was, that kind, was of kind of my guess. guess. Um, actually, hang on. Uh, three. You choose up to three creatures each... Hit point max increased by five for the duration. No, I would rule that stacks. That's stackable. You'd get an additional five hit points. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. I would say that. It, yeah. It's most bonus type. There really aren't bonus types in fifth edition, so it's oh, there's a lot more stacking. And this seems small enough that it wouldn't be a big deal. So. I, 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 get, the I get the impression from the DMG that 
nothing, nothing stacked. stacked. If you have an effect on you, and it's of this thing, thing, it's always the greater one. one. You, don't you don't get two, two of anything. It's always one of something. Hmm. I like your interpretation better than mine. Yeah, it's not a blanket thing, but I, the eight is small enough that I wouldn't count it as being a yeah, it's, game breaker. It's so. not, not putting you, it in God, God mode. No, I, no, was, I was just wondering. wondering. Yeah, I, well, I mean, I, I, I wouldn't say... Who are you going to give it to? Well, well you, you, and and Jugs. And, and but that's, that's like, are you going to do that? Or are you, or are you, yeah, you bring your guardian. Next, next, <laughs> next round, round I, was I was planning on doing it. So you should, so you should stand about behind Clytus, Clytus and I. Right, right. Yeah, yeah bring, bring out your guardians. guardians. So your guardians yep, basically yep. stay within 15 feet of you. So, so. Okay. so I put, so them, I put them out. Uh, let me just and... make your guys, uh, let's just make them kind of golden. And, I, and, I, and, and I'm still, still not sure, not sure how, how to, not, there, oh, you there you go. go. Sweet, sweet. So they, so all, they all have, have to make the wind save. save. Yep, pretty much. <laughs> or, they, or they have to go pee. Yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, so this will be interesting. Now they all have the same wisdom. Yeah. Okay, so what's the DC on this? DC 15? Yeah, yeah. All right, so if they fail, they take seven radiant damage. Okay, so he failed. He failed. He made it. Uh, what did he take? Half? He failed. Take half, so three. So, all, so of all of their movement speeds are half, too. I didn't realize, realize that before. before. Where you begin your turn? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you could designate any number of creatures. I'm assuming you're designating the party members. All of, all of ours. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It'll, it'll whip. Okay. Then uh, it would be Vladimir's turn. Uh, he was outside of this aura. He doesn't like it very much, and uh, he does the whole. Uh, Night King thing and raises his arms and from the ramparts a shitload of phantom warriors appear. Uh, and he then uh, Adrin, you're the one carrying his sword, right? No. no. Uh, Clytus uh, is. Oh, Clytus is. Okay. I'm, 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 carrying I'm sorry. My mistake. Uh, he will move to attack Lytus. Uh He's just got a generic longsword, so... So does so he does have, he to, have make to make the save? the save? Yes, he actually does, as he mm -hmm. enters the area. Uh, so let me just double-check this here. Creature enters the area for the first time on a turn or starts its turn. So yeah, so he made... He entered the area... Fail to save, takes radiant damage, and he then attacks. Clytus. He takes two attacks. First one is 23. Yes. yes. No, that's not the right. What, what? <laughs> I wasn't trying to actually click on that. Uh, da, 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 da. Wow. You did, you get, did a get a plus 2D, 2D your AC. I don't, I don't know, know if that mattered. mattered. Oh. oh. From, from my, well, my well, spell. Yeah, 23. Yeah, 23. I don't, I don't, I don't know what your AC is. What's your AC? It's 19. It's 21 now. Yeah. Yeah. He got a 23. That's rough. That's rough. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, um, yikes. 17 points of damage from one hit. Ow. Ow. Second swing misses. But he does glare at you additionally, so you need to make a DC 15 <laughs> wisdom saving throw. Mm -hmm. 
Woo! -hoo. Ooh, not okay. nice. Uh, he targets you with his vengeful glare, but you manage to avert your eyes before being yeah, hurt. Yeah, bite me, bite buddy. Me, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Phantom Warriors. I put them all in the same initiative since they all kind of appeared after him, so they are all going to go next. And crap, got to look them up here. Aye, 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 aye. These guys aren't as tough, but they all have. Bows, longbows, spectral longbows. Let's make, Let's our, make way our way inside, inside, inside guys. guys. We can fight, we can them, fight from them from the doorway. The doorway. Okay, okay. There it is. Misses. One shoots at Rowan. Misses. One shoots at Adrian. 14, I'm assuming, misses. Yep, yep. Uh, we're going to make our way inside, inside where it's black. I don't, I don't, I don't know how we could do that, that actually, because if, if we disengage, they'll, they'll all get tax, tax opportunity. opportunity. I, 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 I don't know. We can disengage. Fucking fucking fireball. Disengage. Fireball. 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 Jugs, what's your AC? All right. All right. I'm saying saying disengage. They don't. They don't get an attack of opportunity. We just. We just. We just keep moving backwards. That doesn't. Doesn't. Well, if we disengage without attacking, we do not take attack of opportunities. Oh. Jugs, what's your AC? Take a disengage action. I can't hear. But if you want to stay and fight it out. If you want to fight, Jugs. fight it out, that's fine too. Jugs. I'm, I'm figuring, figuring out my, out my AC. Oh, okay. I, have I have studded leather armor. armor. What does that give me? Doesn't your character have AC? I yeah, but it, I it do... says 12. 12, that's and that's not right. right. No. And, and yours was screwed up last time. 12 plus, plus your dex. So 12, so 12 plus, plus my deck, deck which, which is 1, one plus, plus I have a cloak of protection on, on so, it so it should be 14, 14 not, 12. not 12. And you I don't know why my AC's been screwed, screwed, up. screwed up. You have aid going as well? Uh, uh, yeah, I have, yeah, I have the aid. Is that increased that's just my AC? AC? No, that's just your hit points. No, no, just, just 50 hit points. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Studded leather AC is 12. Yeah, yeah so, so I should have 14. Yep, yep. Um, okay. One, one for backs, yeah. yeah. Um, so, oh, any case, uh, one of the uh, spectral longbows hits you and does. Um, um, I, I would cast, would cast shield, shield, so that so gives, that me, gives an me an extra five. five. Does that, does that stop, stop it? it? Yeah, it was a 19, so. Oh, oh. There you go. There you go. Would... Actually, wait, you said you're that, that would still hit, because that, that would make it a 19. Yes, so, he still does hit you. Uh, so yes, uh, you get hit by a spectral arrow for six points of damage, uh, force damage, and um, you have shield up for the remainder of your turn. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that was uh, number four. Uh, that one. Okay, so number five takes another shot at Clytus, uh for twenty-one. Does that hit you? It's just just enough. enough. <sighs> Seven points of force damage, and spectral. Our phantom warrior number six will shoot at uh, Jugs as well. Uh, but your shield this time. Sixteen. Yep, that would block it. Yep, yep. So you managed to block that last one. So those were all the phantom warriors. So we're back to the top. Revenants. Okay, so we've got Revenant 19, 15, 20, 25, 30. He needs to save. He fails. He takes 7 damage. And uh, he's now half his movement, so he can only go 3 more. And that's Revenant number 1. He starts his turn. Fails his save. Takes 7 more damage. And he's got Adrin right in front of him. I think that's him. Yeah, so he's going to attack Adrin. And miss. And the other guy fails his save, takes seven damage, doesn't need to move. He will also attack Adrin and miss. Adrin. All right. All right. <laughs> so. so... If you, guys, if you decide guys decide to move backwards, backwards I'll move back, back after you guys move back. back. 
I can, tell I can teleport and do you know. I can, I can, I can I'm fine. I'm fine. So if you guys want to go, go, then go. I don't care. I don't care. So I'm going to so do I'm this. Do this. I'm going to attack three times. Three times. Watch guy. The guy you, the guy hit, you the hit the first time? time. Yep, yep. No, or no. Yeah. yeah. That, that, they all hit? Uh, yeah, I just can't remember which guy you hit. <clears throat> okay. Uh, yes, that would definitely hit. So, so 36, 6 is radiant, and, and as, as my monk, I'm going to spend a key point, point, and as my monk bonus, bonus action, I'm going to go with patient defense, defense. <clears throat> and um, everybody uh, has, has a disadvantage in attack, attack, attacking me. Okay. Uh, Jugs, uh, if you don't re recall, you only took half that arrow damage because you... I actually, I actually just, just gave myself hit points, points. Okay. back <laughs> because I remembered <laughs> that. I just remembered that too. Okay. Um, and it's your turn. I am, I am going, going to, to take the disengage, the disengage action. action. Okay. And go and inside. Go inside. Uh, can I go inside, I go inside without, without hiding? hiding? Oh yeah, I, oh, yeah, won't, I won't be behind that stuff. That stuff. I don't know what, don't that, know what black that black thing is, thing is but I, I, can I can still see myself, see myself there, there, so it's not hiding us. us. No, it's, it's screwed up. It's on the map level for some reason. Oh, wait. I know what to do here. Hang on. Um, okay, give me a second. Here, maybe bring the map. There we go. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. So are, so are these Phantom, Phantom Warriors, Warriors inside? inside or or they're on, on, the roof. on this, this level, level, they're on the roof. They are on the roof presently, so... Yeah. so yeah. So I'm going so to move, move in to like here, here so, that so that there's enough, enough room for someone, for someone else, else to get in. Go to one side of the door. Can, can still... still... Well, I want to leave, leave enough room for someone, someone else to get in. Okay. okay. Piddle, Piddle work is, is kind of blocked kind of block away, but I'm going to do, I'm gonna do that, that, and then I'm going to cast a firebolt. If you do that... They would, they would get attacks of opportunity on you because if you, if you disengage, if you disengage, that's all you can do. You, you, can't, do. you, can't, do you can't do anything else. Yeah, but I, yeah, but I can cast, cast a spell as a bonus, bonus action. action. But but in order in order to disengage, to disengage you, cannot you cannot attack. attack. So, I so I can't disengage, disengage as, my as my action and cast a spell as my bonus, bonus action. If it's if it's an attack spell, then no. Okay. Okay. Then never mind. No, it no, just it just says, says if you if take as a disengage action, action, your movement doesn't provoke tax of opportunity for the rest of the turn, period. period. Yeah. It doesn't, doesn't yeah. say anything about bonus action, action. so, I would, so I would say that works. Yeah, I would actually rule that as well. Uh, basically, your action, when you took your action, that was your disengage with your action. But if you get a bonus action, that's in addition to your action. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, sure. Because yeah, I, yeah, I thought disengage, disengage doesn't, allow doesn't allow you to actually... You to actually... Nope, nope. It's not what it, not what it says. It's only one sentence. That's kind of take... Yeah, you're kind of taking fifth, uh, third edition rules for that, I think. So I'm going to so cast... cast uh, uh, actually, actually... I'm going to cast, gonna cast Ray, of Ray of Frost, Frost at, at that, one. that one. Okay. Yeah, I would say you could see through the door and be able to target him. I think, I think that's, that's probably, probably the only one I could, so, so that's if I'm picking him. him. That's a cantrip. And, right? and yep, yep. Uh, twelve's not quite enough. I will. I will use, use my advantage. advantage. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, then it would be eighteen. That would hit. So, so, hit, for hit for four. four. And then, and then his. his uh, uh, a, a character who uses his action to disengage cannot use his action for anything else on the same turn. turn. Right. His action. I'm using, I'm using action. a bonus action. Bonus, bonus action, action is different. Yep. Right. I'm just. I'm just saying, if you do attack, attack though, not as, not as a bonus action. action. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, yeah. Yeah. You do could do one or the, one or the other, other as an action, action but, I'm but I'm doing it as a bonus action. You only get one action a turn. Period. No matter what, bonus actions are. Yeah. yeah. And then, and then his, his uh, speed, uh, speed is, is reduced by ten, by 10 feet. Okay. And he's as well. Yeah. Uh, oh. And it's, and it's halved. So. And, so. and it's halved already. It's halved from his from Rowan swirly right, guys. Right. The yeah, ten yeah. feet is an absolute reduction from the ray of frost, right? Yep. 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 Okay. So. 
Uh, I can't remember which whether that piles up before or not, so I'm just gonna say it's down to twenty and half, so he just has ten foot movement. Okay. okay. Uh, it's actually his turn now, so uh, he will take a save. And uh, I can't read that. I put, I put my little icon, icon for Tides, Tides of Chaos, Chaos as well. As well. So you remember. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, <laughs> so I can give you more immunities. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, try. He failed his save, so he takes another seven. Uh, he is going to move over here. Actually, he's going to move up to here. Nobody's on a square, so that's, uh, he is going to attack Rowan because he really doesn't like those swirly guys. Yeah. Yeah. Use his long sword. Bad miss. Second attack. Uh, 19? Yeah, that yeah, hits. Okay, so, hits you with his spectral lung sword, dealing a grand total of uh, 15 points of slashing damage. Jeez, Jesus. Oh, wait, yeah, he's sworn vengeance on you, so you actually take also on top of that an additional 9. An additional 15 points of damage. <laughs> 30, 30 points? points? Yep. <laughs> you guys have been, they've sworn vengeance against you for desecrating their, the skull of Argenvost and, uh, okay, Sir Godfrey is going to take a five foot step back out of the fray and, um, hmm, yeah, he doesn't want, he really doesn't like those swirly guys either. Uh, he's gonna move around here. Actually, he's gonna move around here. Just dash over to there, around the circle. His, his, his idea. idea. Bad bastard. Yeah, it's not like he has any control over it. Not as long as Vladimir's around. Uh, okay, a Revenant. We'll see, we'll about, see that about that in another round. Fails a save. Yeah, the silly thing keeps beeping at me. He moves through his allies to there and attacks Adrin at disadvantage. Okay. 22? Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> disadvantage. What was, what his, was other his other role? role? Um. <laughs> Uh, 21, actually. <laughs> oh, oh so, then, so then 21 is what? Yes. It's still, it's still it's still yeah, yeah. <laughs> but still, but still that, that 21, 21 into 22. Into 22. <laughs> 2d10 plus 4d6. Twenty-nine points of damage. And oh, he gets a second attack. That was just that was one, just hit. one hit. That was oh, oh, who's Adrian? that on? Adrian. 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 Second one though, he only got uh, an eleven, so he missed. Uh, so Revan, stay, out, stay out here. <laughs> Number five. He. F well, I was well, thinking, I was thinking two, two fireballs, fireballs from, from the wizards, wizards might have turned turn the tide. The tide. But, but it's good, good. <clears throat> yeah, about, yeah, about that. that. I don't, I don't have, have a fireball. fireball. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. There you, there you go. go. <laughs> okay, he moves up to Clytus. I do. I do. Uh, wait, he doesn't well, have Clytus is in there. Clytus doesn't have. He doesn't have disadvantage, which is lucky because did, did one he, of those numbers I rolled was a twenty. Did he? Did he pass, pass or, or fail, fail his, his save? save? He failed his save. Okay. Okay. You're slowly, You're slowly chipping, chipping away at him, Rowan. Rowan. Yeah. Uh, 14, I'm assuming, misses. Uh, yep, how about yep. an 18? Miss. Miss. Okay, so he missed you both times. It is now Clytus' turn. Oh, Lord. Um, do, I, do I have anything... 
right. All right. I, I will, will disengage, disengage to here. here. Actually, actually, to, to here. here. And the only and thing, the only thing you can do with your, your bonus, bonus action is with a haste. What is your speed? Oh, your haste. Uh, okay. haste. Five, 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 ten, 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 haste. Ten, 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 plus some plus haste. Some haste yeah. 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 So, so I can I can only attack, attack with the bonus, with the bonus action, action from haste. From haste. You get you get an extra attack action. You get an extra attack action or an extra dash action. Yeah, so I could cast, cast a spell, a spell I, guess, I guess, is what I'm saying. You no, still, still you couldn't could, disengage yes. and cast a spell. With my, with my bonus, bonus action from my haste? From my no, your bonus is, action does yeah. not allow you to cast a spell. The action, the, 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 haste the haste action can be used to disengage. So he can use his regular action to cast a spell and disengage. Or I could attack and disengage because my attack is a bonus. Is that correct? From your haste, yes. All right, All right. Uh, who, uh, who looks, looks the, the most, most hurt, hurt around, around me? me? Uh, you really can't tell. All right, All right. I'm going to hit the one, the one in front of me. He's been, been hit a couple times. times. Well, and I, well, hit, and I hit him pretty hard last round, so I'm going to hit him again. Hit him again. Okay. Same guy. Same guy. This, this guy. Um, Wait, the guy. That's not the same guy Adrian hit before. This guy? This guy? That guy's no, not no. the same guy Adrian hit before. Yeah, the, yeah, the one, one I hit before. Okay. Both hit. Okay. Okay. Plus two D four. Yep. <laughs> I'm, on, I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm on it. Nice. Thirty two. Yep. Yep. And, and as, as my, my... No, I'm gonna now I'm going to save that. that. Um, so then, so I, then take I take my disengage, my disengage action and, and go, go here. here. Okay. Didn't kill, Didn't kill him, though. Nope. Oh, my right. God. Well, well I'm 60-some damage, some damage into him. Yeah. And he's still, and he's still alive, alive, so that's, so that's awesome. awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. I'm just saying, uh, just saying he's hurt. Pedalic uh, fires a dart at the Revenant right in front of him. <laughs> Hits him. Kills him. Kills him. <laughs> no. Kills. Does, uh, does 89 damage. damage. Yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> uh, doesn't appear to be too affected by the poison in his dart, so he just takes regular damage. Uh, but he turns around and glares at Pedalwick. Pedalwick doesn't seem to change any facial expression, except he does turn around and bolt into the... <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Good job, Good job Pedalwick. Um, Rowan's up. Okay. okay. Oh, oh man. man. I mean, I, I mean, I can't, I can't flee. flee. You can so just disengage. Yeah, but yeah, but then I can't, then do, I can't do anything because I'm, I'm not yeah, hasted. That's, that's, that's okay. You still, you still have your movement. <laughs> you don't. You don't want to uh, die. It beats, it beats dying. dying. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. True. 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 But I mean, I mean, if I cast. I cast like a like fireball, a fireball and, I'm and I'm in it, in it I take, I the, take damage the damage too, or, or no? Yes, 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 you yes, do. yes. yes. Just come, just come inside. inside. Yeah, yeah. I'm just engaged. Come inside, Rowan. You could, you could, you could, you could, you could, you could take up a couple attacks, attacks of opportunity. There's only two. two. Disengaging <laughs> will get you to the door, but not through it. You can't move you through an enemy occupied square. You could take. In fact, you could go. Five. You, could, you, could you could get one attack of opportunity if you just go, well, because this, this guy's not in. I thought, wait, I thought there's, there's only one person that's within, within five, five feet of right? you. There's, there's just one dude who's within five feet of you. So you could just, you could move, just move to the, to the door, door and then cast, and then cast fireball. fireball. And set it right on me. He'd get one attack of opportunity on you. Yeah, but their one attack is like... Can you please move yourself back to exactly where you were? That's where, that's where I was. Yeah. That's where he was. That's where he was. That's where no, he was. I don't think he moved himself. Because, because Clytus, Clytus was, here. was here. Yeah, I was, yeah, okay. I was here. Yeah, so I'm just trying to determine where you're at. Right now, you would yeah, drive. Yeah. Right now, you're only threatened by the Revenant right below you. Okay. Okay. It's Hang on. Let me just rearrange this so we're all in a friggin' square. Yeah. yeah. It's pissing me off. A square. I can't count <laughs> non-squares. There. Well, that makes, well, that makes him technically, technically threatened, threatened by two, two now. now. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. So we, you'd have to be. Yeah. So you are threatened by two. It's up to it's you. Up to you. You can, you run. can run. 
But if, but I, if, I, if, I, if disengage, I disengage, I don't, I don't get any, get any attacks, attacks of opportunity. opportunity. Correct. Yep. Correct. Yep. But I can't, but I can't do, do another action. Because nope. no. I'm, I'm not hasted. Yeah, I'm yeah, going to do that. So you so said, you I, said can I can get, get to the door? The door? Uh, you could just actually just get in the door. Right there. Five. five ten, ten. Yeah, it was 15, hard to tell when you were kind of in the middle of an intersection there. Yeah, yeah. 20, okay. You can move, you can move farther in. in. No. Yeah, yeah you, you could go. go that's, only that's only 20 to where you are. I think, I think diagonally, diagonally it's technically, technically more than, than it's like seven, seven and a half, half yeah, isn't it's, it? It's, it's, yeah. Not, it's not in the fifth edition. That, that, fifth edition, diagonal. yeah, we can just do five. We'll do simple movements. Would that, would that be okay, okay then? then? Sure. All right, all right. Stay, stay there then. Okay. So now all the revenants are outside. The <laughs> going to go. get a lot of shots <laughs> right, right now. Uh, the animal warriors yeah, so are going to love you. Okay, Vladimir, <laughs> uh, he does another vengeful glare on you, Adrin. DC 15 wisdom save. Ooh, you are paralyzed. Oh, oh, my, oh my god. And uh, yeah, but, yeah, but. you are he basically he, you're paralyzed until he does damage to you. But uh, he's going to not attack you. He's going uh, to attack no, you. I do. I get the, I get the it's another, it's another roll there, there but <laughs> can I can I do an inspiration on that one if it would? Inspiration would get you advantage which wouldn't help you in that case. Okay. Okay. Shit. <clears throat> okay. Phantom Warriors are all going to shoot at Adrin because he's really the only target left. And all right, so they each get two shots <laughs> of the written. spectral longbow. Um, now you get disadvantage on all attacks against you, right? Still. Yep. Yep. Okay. So that basically neutralizes. Uh, no, it doesn't. They still get two attacks, but they're all disadvantage. Oh boy, lots of dice rolling. Failed. Failed. That disadvantage is helping you. That's what I was hoping for. Uh, let's see. You are paralyzed. I gotta look this up. What does that do to your AC? Shit. Condition paralyzed. You are incapacitated. You fail strength dex attack rolls. Have to, oh, okay. Uh, actually, all that disadvantage is neutralized because attack rolls against you have advantage. Yes. Yeah, yeah, so it's just, just, just one roll. roll. All right. Uh, yeah. Any attack that hits. Uh, it's, okay, that doesn't count because you're not within five feet. Uh, what is incapacitated? Take action, reaction. Okay, so actually no AC effect. Um, failed. Ooh, that one definitely would hit. Oh wait, these guys don't have... They just get a puny D8. One hit point of force damage. Failed and uh, eighteen, I think. Does eighteen hit you? No, no. Okay, they all, they all failed, except for the one that hit. Okay, revenants. Now you got a bunch of revenants all around you here, and uh, let's see. We did do flanking rules, but that guy's not flanking, so he would attack and miss and attack. Does 20 hit you? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Ah, sorry, I keep clicking on that and I don't mean to. <laughs> Six. 35 points of damage. Jesus. Oh, wait. Um, paralyzed. That's an auto crit. I'm at zero. You're at zero. Hey, at least shot a combat. You're at zero anyway. I, I, if you, if you said it's a crit, crit I'm, I'm going to be at zero. zero. I only six got six hit points. Well, I just need to roll the dice again. Go ahead. Go ahead. So 35 plus. Twenty-eight. 
29. 30, 35 plus 29? Yes. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's greater than fucking 45. Yeah. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, I didn't know what your number was. <laughs> yeah, so total 64 points with a crit. Uh, isn't there some, isn't there some kind of massive, massive damage? damage? Yeah. I don't, I don't, well, well, 5e, five e you go to zero. Yeah, so what, how much How much are you below zero? Yeah, but, yeah, but if... So, so it was, I'm 15, I'm 15 below, below, so that, so is, that is below my max, max constitution. constitution. It's, so you, so are you are not dead. 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 You're, at you're at zero. Yeah, you're at zero. No, no, it is, it is greater, greater than, than my 14. If I'm 15 under, under it's greater. Oh, it's greater. not your constitution. It's your max hit point. Oh, no, 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 no. It is, I, it's your max, it's your max hit point. Um, yeah, I think, yeah, I think it, it is. It is. Yeah. Okay, well, okay, that's, well good. that's good. Yeah, you're not dead, dead. You're just at zero. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, okay, so the other evidence will see. You went down. Uh, Revenant picks up your long magical longsword, uh, hands it to Vladimir. That was, that was Clytus. What? He still, oh, he still has oh, a magical right. longsword. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, oh, I, I, oh, Clytus yeah. is the one with the um, yeah, his. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he, would, he wouldn't pick up mine. No, he wouldn't pick up yours. No, yeah, yeah. It is. It your is your maximum hit points. Yep. Yeah. Um, blah 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 blah. So this Revenant. Okay, so he moves up to Clytus. And is going to attack. Uh, is 19 hit? No. No. 24. Yes. Yes. Stop that. Stop that. <laughs> 20 points. Jeez, Jesus. And this revenant uh, moves up to the door. Uh, Adrin, you can make a death save. Oh, one fail. Jugs. Hey, is there hey, a range, range spell, spell uh, David, uh, David, on the on that, on that uh, uh, word word word, word, word off the dying or whatever it's called? Oh, did these two? Yeah, these two guys actually did need to make a save. Hang on. And they both failed. Revivify one? No, no, no. The one that the the, the cantrip you cast, cast, cast on the kid at the end. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, spare the dying. Yeah. 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 Is there a range on that? Or do you have, or do you have touch? Yeah. Yeah. Crap. Crap. <sighs> Dugs. Yeah. yeah. Trying, trying to decide what I want to do. do. Ah, wreck, wreck. Um, um, I'm, I'm going, going to, to from, where from right where I'm standing, standing cast, cast uh, Ray of Ray Frost, Frost on the one, on the one in the doorway. Okay. And, and, and I'm a mess, I'm assuming. assuming. Uh, uh, you already used your advantage, right? Well, I, use, I, use, I mean, I mean, if we, if get, we get inspiration, I can that. use that. I thought you used that already. No, I used, no, I used my, my tides, tides of chaos. chaos. Oh, there's your tides of chaos. Okay, uh, if you use your inspiration, you'll hit him. <laughs> yeah, I'll, yeah use I'll use it. Thirteen's what you need. So nine, so nine cold, cold, and, and his, movement his movement speed, speed is, reduced is reduced by ten. Okay. Yeah, he was very. And then, and then I'm going, going to move, to move back, back here. here. I think, I think, or, or well, I guess, well, I guess yeah, that yeah, door's, door's not tech. I don't, I don't know, I don't know if that door's in the way of me standing, standing there, there, but I'm gonna stand, stand there. there. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right, we got a revenant. Um, okay, uh, two of the revenants with Sir Godfrey pick up the skull and start heading away with it. They don't get very far. But they're carrying it off. You don't know where. Um, open, open it, put it back where it belongs. Let's, let's they it. don't seem to be heading in the direction of the mausoleum. And he's going to stand outside the area of effect. Clytus! Got two revenants. Well, only one really you can mm -hmm. attack through the door. 
Um, Bar, I'm, Bar I'm still gonna... hasted, I remember. Yep, yep, I know. I know. So I'm going to so go ahead and whack, whack him. him. Nice. nice. Definitely hits. And this, and this time, time I'm, going I'm going to do, do my... my... So I do, so all, I do that, all that, and then I'm going to do... Divine, Divine Smite. Smite. They are, they are we don't, we don't, we don't, we don't get, get that 2d4, 2D4 anymore, anymore, do we? Oh yeah, Adrian. 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 Yeah, oh, we don't? Oh, we don't? Glow, the glow thing goes is, that, is that a concentration spell? spell? Well, I don't, well, I don't know. It's based off his sword. It's based off his sword. sword. So it's, sword. Really it's, the it's the sword. sword. So that's so what I'm asking. It's an, it's an intelligent sword, sword so it's, it, can't it can't move. move. You gotta stay within it. It should be okay. Yeah, it is an intelligent sword. Yeah, I would say, actually, that that would... I would let it still keep going. Alright, so, right, so I... realizes what you're trying to do here and wants to help. Alright, alright. Uh, um, and, and then I do an additional. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna my, use divine my divine smite. smite. So I burn, so I burn a first, first level spell, spell and, I get, and I get that. Wow, okay, so 21 plus 23. Ouch! He is barely standing. And I get, and my, I get bonus my bonus action, action correct? correct? My bonus, my bonus haste. Yeah, you're hasted, so. Yeah. yeah. So, that's, so that's a normal double. double. I get two I get attacks, attacks right? then, right? Because that's, Cause my, that's normal. my normal. Or is it just, or is it just one, one attack? attack? It's just one attack. Okay. Okay. Because, oh, because uh, I, get uh, I get extra attack, attack, attack you can attack twice instead of once whenever you take an attack action on your turn. So would that be And he is taking an attack action. Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay. So, so the, the first one probably, one probably missed the 11? 11. Yes, but the second one definitely missed. Boom! You knock him dead! He falls to the ground and Yay. dies. Again. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Piddlewick. Uh, let's see. Shoot the dart, dart Piddlewick! He steps up. <laughs> Bing! Fires at the other revenant, but misses, and then quick steps back. Oh no! <laughs> uh, Rowan, whoa, hello. That was what? Weird. What? Uh, roll twenty just went completely white for a second, and then. Oh, oh, that's yeah. weird. Um, you um, still, still have your guardians up, don't you, Rowan? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean the, so the, so this move. one still, still in the area. area. If I move, if I move five, five feet, feet this, this way, way. If, if I get in the doorway like that. that the other, the other ones are in, in, but I was, I was trying, trying to get. get I, was I was thinking, thinking of moving here, here and, uh, and would, I, would I be able to see him? him? Uh, yes, you would. Through that, through that doorway. Yes. Okay, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try, try this. this. And, uh, I know it's probably, probably a long, a long shot, shot, but I've never, I've never used this spell before. before. Banishment. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, so he needs to make a charisma saving throw. Is he within 60 feet? Okay. Oh, yeah. He's within 60 feet. Uh, so let's see. This is not just any revenue. This is Vladimir Horn's guard. Yeah, yeah he's, probably he's probably got, got, a, good got a good charisma, charisma too. He's got a plus four charisma. Uh, he needs to make a DC 15, I'm assuming. Yep. yep. Charisma save. Oh, <laughs> come on! Oh, he got a 10! <laughs> yes! Okay, yes! so you have banished him now. This is a concentration spell, so he's basically banished. And since this is at Barovia that you're in, he basically yeah, was yeah. sent to the ethereal border ethereal. Um, yeah, whatever. Yeah. So you basically um, have to concentrate uh, in, until the duration on, on this. Yeah, yeah. That he is banished. All right, so I'm just going to let's see what would be a good one to do here. Yeah, he is banished, and I'll just move him to the, off the map there. Okay. So Vladimir, uh, it was his turn, but now he's incapacitated and in another plane entirely. So uh, the Phantom Warriors, huh? Um. Well. Uh, their target, they don't have any targets out there, except Adrian, who's already down. Um, oh, wait, they're, uh, they can go incorporeal. Uh, yeah, so they just drop through the floor, right in front of you guys. Oh. Uh, let's see, let's see, Do it. that guy isn't there, that guy isn't there, that guy isn't there, that guy's not there, but. 
this guy is. Uh, he, I'll say, he appears, pops down right next to Rowan. Uh, and he's got rid of his spectral longbow, and instead he's got a spectral long sword. Um, actually, you know what? Um, that was more than 30 feet. So he had to basically ethereally dash through the floor, so he can't get an attack. Does he, Does take, he take damage, damage from, that from that area of effect <coughs> um, around, around Rowan? Does that affect, that affect him? I would assume he'd need to make a save. Yeah. yeah. Spirit, Spirit Guardians, Guardians is no more. Is no more. Spirit Guardians is, is, that, is that a concentration? concentration? They're both they're concentration, both concentration so banishment oh, yeah, is, yeah, is, yeah, is the new spell. spell. Yep. Yeah. yeah, you're right. You're right. I, didn't I didn't know Spirit, know Spirit Guardians, Guardians was concentration. concentration. I wasn't aware either. So, never mind. Ah, uh, damn it. There... And let's see, Revenant. Uh, well, he's going to step up into the gap. Aren't they, aren't they, aren't they, aren't they afraid, afraid now? They don't, they, they, don't, they don't care, care anymore. anymore. The boss, the boss is, gone. is gone. Come on, come on, commit the DM. DM. It's true. It's true. Hmm. Isn't, Isn't the other, the guy, other guy, guy now their leader? leader? I, don't, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, man, come on, man. man. We brought the skull. The skull. Concentration, Concentration isn't, isn't checked on that guardian spell. Yes, it is. It is. Duration, Duration, concentration, concentration up to 10 minutes. minutes. Oh, I'm not going to have a different one. Never mind. <laughs> um, Guardian of Faith. faith. That's the one Actually, let's at. see. Um, where was he? Here? Yeah, yeah. All right, all right, I think. I think. Here. Here. I'm going to say that he, this particular one, uh, is going to carry out his last. His master's last command. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna roll it for each one of these guys until countermanded or told otherwise. Um, so he attacks Clytus. Uh, yeah, 24. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Damn, Stop, that. Stop that. Um, yeah. Could yeah. You could not... you not? Uh, 18 points. That. Sure. That drops, that drops me, me to zero. zero. Oh! His second attack misses. Um, that revenant is dead. So he's not doing a damn thing. Get off there. Uh, that revenant. Uh, he's just. Uh, he's not sure what to do because his boss is gone. Adrian, you can make a death save. I'm gonna yell, I'm gonna to, yell that to that guy, guy to, to call them call off. Them off. <laughs> well, it's not your turn yet. I can, I can, can't you can't yell, yell on any turn? turn? Technically, no. Uh, okay. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. It's your turn now. <laughs> I, I am going to die. We are going to die. I'm gonna yell, I'm gonna yell for him to call them, them off. off. Okay. It's all right. It's all right. I, I have revivified if I live. Um, let's see. Can you make? Is, it a, is there a persuasion skill? Uh, yeah, persuasion. Yeah, persuasion. Yeah, persuasion. persuasion check. Persuasion check. Yeah. Yeah. Make a persuasion yeah. check. Nice. Nice. All right. Okay, so you, uh, what do you say exactly to him? I forget, I his, forget name, his name, but I... Sir Godfrey was his name. Yeah, Sir, yeah, Godfrey. Sir Godfrey. We're here We're to, here to return, return the skull. The skull. We, we want to bring it back to its rightful resting place. place. Call, them, Call them, off. them off, and we'll help, and we'll help you. you. All right, so Godfrey stops, turns, and considers you for a moment. And then he lets go of the skull. Or he actually he wouldn't just drop it. Uh, he would actually, well, he lets go of it and says to the other revenants, well, Vladimir is gone. Do as he says. Uh, the revenants bring the skull towards you. All right. All right. Uh, do we want to drop out of combat, or are you guys going to keep fighting? Well, oh, well no. they're not going to fight. They're not going to fight. We're not going to fight. Sir Godfrey <laughs> has gonna... it, uh, basically kind of asserted control in the absence of Vladimir. I'm dead. I'm dead. Well, no, 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 If you drop out of combat, yeah, but he can. Yeah. Okay, then we'll let you guys. I would let you guys. Yeah, take actions. Technically, he would get a turn before you. So if you want to drop out of combat, yeah. So Clytus, yeah. If you want a quick rush to save him, 
the revenants stand back. Clytus, Clytus is down. down. Yeah, Clytus, yeah, Clytus is, is down. down. Oh, yeah. So wrong. Oh, oh, okay. I, made, I made my first death save. Okay, yeah. So <laughs> go, go, go get Evan. Um, Piddlewick can try. <laughs> well, well, I don't want to watch Piddlewick try. <laughs> this would be amusing. Go, and, go, and Piddlewick. I'm, I'm next anyway, anyway so. so. Well, no, Piddlewick is up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what is a heel check here? Isn't it? Um, let's see. Does he have? It's just, it's your, just your heel skill, skill and then. Is that, is that a medicine check? Is that, is yeah, that, yeah, yeah. It's, it's your, your it's your medicine check. check. Yeah. Yeah. He doesn't. So, so he's 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 try he can't. He doesn't know how to do it. So. Uh, it's up to you, Rowan. <laughs> Rowan, just, Rowan, do, just your, do your do that. Do that uh, stay off, off the dying or whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. So. Yeah, the revenants will move out of your way. I want to do better than that. That's it? That's it? We got a, we nine, got a 9 and a 5. And a five. 14. That's 14. Oh, a 9, oh, a nine, and, nine and a 5. five. Okay. Alright, so you uh, apply curative power to Adrin. Adrin, you awaken. And uh, you see a bunch of revenants actually now standing motionless. Uh, you don't see Vladimir anywhere, and uh, the two of the revenants are carrying the skull towards you. Oh, oh, wait, wait! Can I can do I that do that while, while maintaining while concentration, or no? Or no? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, okay. okay. Well, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Right, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go uh, use a medicine, use a medicine check, check on uh, Clytus. <clears throat> Minutes ticking by. Yeah. Yeah. So, so we. Okay. okay. Well, I would assume twenty twenty four does it. <laughs> Let's take, let's take this. Storm stable. Okay. Yeah. 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 You, you, guys you guys do that. Do that I'll... I'll. Yeah, that was good because Clytus had two failures with that save. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, I'm gonna, so I'm gonna tell them. Tell them let's, let's, let's take the skull, the skull into, into the. the... Wherever, wherever they want, they want it. it. Okay. Take, take it. Well, to they the to the resting place. place. They say it's. It's up to you where you want to take it. Um, does Sir, does Sir Godfrey, Godfrey know where? where... He says, uh, uh, it, is it where, it where it belongs? He should, I, I imagine he knows, he knows where, it where it belongs. He actually doesn't know. He didn't read any of um, the dragon's memoirs or anything like you guys did. Yeah, but we, yeah, but we, don't, we don't remember that. that. <laughs> as, 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 as players, <laughs> right? As, as characters, you would remember them basically... The mausoleum is where he wanted to be laid to rest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. So, yeah, so, yeah, I would, I would tell, tell them, let's take it to the mausoleum. Okay. Uh, so, hauling ass to try and get there before a minute passes? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And, and I, I, mean, I mean, if, if it makes it, makes it, it easier, easier, I'll help them carry okay. it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you guys combined uh, can do that and uh, carry the bones, the skull, to the mausoleum and let's see what happens when that occurs okay all right so um when the skull of argonvost is placed in the dragon's mausoleum the dragon's spirit transforms into a brilliant light that fills this room and flashes across the valley like the beacon of a lighthouse awesome. awesome um it actually reaches the sky and the light in the uh goes up to the tower top of the tower and uh, remains where it is flashing in the sky like pulsing um, and you can tell at immediately that the spirit of Argonvost has come to be at rest. You kind of feel this sigh of release permeate the entire grounds. Um, and the other remnants fade from view. Um, Sir Godfrey, um, takes another moment and says, thank you. You have done much that is good here. Vladimir's curse has been lifted. Now we can go to rest. Uh, thank and thank he you. He eventually fades from view. Um, Rowan, you can tell that you no longer need to maintain your concentration, that Vladimir uh, 
has basically given up and he um the residents now see a light as a reminder of all that was once good and noble about the knightly order to which they once belonged. They let go of their hatred and their corporeal bodies, leaving corpses behind mm -hmm. as their spirits find rest at long last. Be quiet, 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 quiet you're unconscious. Uh, but will be happy. Okay. Uh, so you've, lit in, you've returned the bones of Argenvost. You've lit in the beacon of Argenvost. Of protection, and while the beacon shines, characters and other creatures that oppose Strahd gain a plus one bonus to AC and saving throws for as wow. long as you remain in Barovia. Oh, wow. hey. So you can hey, add that. That's so, cool. That I, I am going, going to teleport to the top, to the top of, the of the tower, and grab, and grab that freaking amulet, amulet that's, that's up there, there that's that we, that we couldn't yes. grab before. Yes! Oh, oh. <laughs> smart. He is, he is smart. smart. <laughs> That was well, that was, that was, was the whole point of doing, doing this, yeah, right? That was uh, you basically now you get to the top, and the um, this goes, this goes on, on um, Clytus. Clytus. 15, 15 for Clytus. Yay, Yay thank holy you. symbol of Ravenkind. <laughs> All right, is a da, 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 da. actually, I think I already showed you this in the handouts if i'm not mistaken so do we so just do we remember, remember the plus, the plus one, one on the saving throws from now should, should we add that you can add that as a AC. permanent bonus okay okay where do we, where do, do, we do that on your, on your character, character sheet. sheet right right just, just in, in armor, armor class just, just add one or, or what you can manually add one yeah. no 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 no, 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 no for the for the saving throw i mean oh wait oh wait we get a plus one to saving throws too yes yeah 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 oh shoot <clears throat> I'm not 100% sure how to do that on the character sheet because I think those are so there, so there is, is under, under attributes, attributes and abilities, and abilities uh, uh, to the next option first, first yeah I don't, yeah, I don't think, we, think can we can add anything, anything. I, think I think you just gotta remember it alright so alright all right. Oh, there's, oh, there's uh, a. If you if go, you go under, under the, the little wheel, wheel next, next to spells, and then you, and then you look at uh -huh. saving throws, it says, it says global, global saving, saving throw modifier. modifier. You, you can put a one in there. Oh. oh, cool, oh, cool. Yep, that'll yeah, work. Yeah. All right. Uh, if you can give me a second here, I'm copying and pasting something. And I'm going to say that uh, while you're here, uh, so the basically the. Argon Vosthold is now safe for you to spend the night in, pretty much. Yeah, yeah, nice. nice. You'll get to take a long rest if you wish. Yeah, yeah. I think, uh, I think we wish. We wish. <laughs> right, hang on. I'm just, I'm testing. just testing. Uh, I'm entering. Uh, uh, work, work. work. Uh, I can't, uh, can't tell. tell. Well, my, well, my dexterity is. is... A five, a five, I get. Or yes, yes, it does help. Yes, it, yes, it works. It works. Yeah, my, yeah, my deck is zero, zero, so. so. It, 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 it just, just adds, adds one to the saving throw, throw in your, in your, yeah, in your yeah. character sheet. Yep, yep. So, so perfect. perfect. You, do you do a plus, plus one, one or, just or just a one? one? I, just, I, just I just put, put just a one in there. Oh, I did. It just adds one to each of your saves. So, so we have no, we have idea, no idea what this thing, thing does, does uh, right? I'm in the process of getting Yeah. Alright, right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, get the restroom quick. Yeah, I'm assuming, yeah, assuming when he said he was copying and pasting, and that's what he, what he was doing. doing. I see, there we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I, was, I, I was reading it, Seneca. Here we go. Uh, turn on red. Paladin of good alignment. Well, not me. Well, that is either myself or Rowan, is it not? You're the, you're the only cleric, cleric or paladin, paladin yeah. so yeah. Well, what, well, is, what Rowan? is Rowan? He's a cleric. He's a cleric. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so, so, so myself for Rowan, for Rowan can use this. Yep, yep, either, either of you. Yeah, we'll <coughs> tune to it. Uh, well, you, you I'm guys, fine either way. Yeah, you guys basically get the impression that you would know that it kind of calls to both of you, so you would kind of both know that one of you could attune yeah, to this. Yeah. Does it, does it seem, seem so, it's so it's holy symbol of Ravenkind, of Ravenkind would, that would that be something, be something that, that Rowan wouldn't like as a priest of Lathander, necessarily? No. 
I don't know, I don't if, know if raven kind, kind is another god, god or, or I, don't, I don't know what that, know what that means. means. No, it's basically the raven kind. You can hold, hold a vampire. No, you'd have no problem with this. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is uh, one of the items that Madam Eva foretold would be very useful in fighting Strahd. I.e., you wouldn't get killed in this extent. Um, yeah, so I guess you and Dave can fight over who gets it. Let's still start, Let's still start with, with David. Yeah, yeah. You and, you and me have to, have to worry, worry about, about this holy symbol. symbol. Um, one, um, of one of us can, us can, use, can it. use it. No, one of you can attune to it. It's yeah. not like yeah. you can just attune to it. Yeah, it um, takes a um, short rest to attune to something. Um, I don't know. I, don't I mean, either... either doesn't matter, doesn't matter to me. Do you, Do you want, want it? it? Yeah, and Tim's froze. <laughs> I almost think, I almost think it's, it's more useful, useful on Rowan because Clytus, Clytus would like, would like to get his attacks off. off. Sure, sure. And, and using, using those I abilities lost you for a minute. What, what, uh, are going to take, up, take an up an action rather, rather than using, using his attacks. attacks. Lost you again. So, so, I don't know. I don't know. Are you there, Tim? Looks, it looks like I he's losing audio. audio. He's losing audio, audio. He and left, he left, it looks like. like. Or is he back? Is he back? No. no. How about now? I don't, I don't even see him with the... Yeah, 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 he's, gone. he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Paul, Paul go. I lost Paul and I lost... So where so do you do, you do the... Global? global? All right, hang on. I'll... Can you guys, can you guys hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Oh, uh, there it is. Okay. okay. So, so David, David, what did you, did you want it, or did you? Am I, am I, this is the settings, settings, yeah, and then under, under save, save options. options. Yep, yep, I found it. Finally, finally. I'm, I'm slow. I mean, I mean it, it, Jugs, Jugs was, was saying that, that he, thinks he thinks it might, it be, might more be more beneficial, beneficial if I have, have this thing, thing, so you, so can, you can keep doing, keep doing your attacks and don't have to waste an action on this. That's true. That's true. Because I'm, Cause I'm, I'm, I'm using, using more, more in the back, back anyway. Okay. Okay. Is that makes, that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. Is Tim on? Yeah. I can hear him. I don't, I don't, I don't see, see him even. Tim, I, I, I hear him. Tim. I can't, I can't see Tim. Yeah. Everyone's talking over each other here. Hang on. Um, Tim, can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Okay. Nobody else can hear or see you, so I'm going to drop you from the call and re-add you. Oh. Oh. David and I have been have been talking. No, this is screwed. Yeah, I yeah, can, I can see, see and hear him, which is, which weird. is weird. Yeah, yeah. Uh, only, only me and Paul couldn't. couldn't. Okay. So, yeah, so yeah, drop him and bring him back. Okay, yeah, just, yeah, drop, just drop me and bring me back, back this one. Okay. Uh, i got to figure out how to do that. Hang on. That? No. Or he, or can, he exit, can exit, maybe. maybe. Yeah, I think you have yeah, to. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, have him close BC. I will, I will add, add that to my, to my list. list. There he is. That was weird. That was weird. I, could I could hear David and Paul, and Paul but, I couldn't, but I couldn't hear you guys. We couldn't, we couldn't hear, or hear or see you either. either. Yeah, weird. yeah, weird. That was bizarre. BC acting up again. All right. Um, in any case, have you guys decided which of you will... Yeah, I think, yeah, I think I'm, I'm going, going to attune, attune to it. it. I just, I just think, think it makes the most sense, sense since Tim, Tim you'll, you'll probably, probably want to be up front, front attacking, attacking, and that would that would take an action, take an yeah, action yeah, away sense. from you. Yeah, yeah, I agreed, I agreed to, to it when you guys, when you guys were, were off. off. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're. Um, so this actually, if you recall, was foretold as the item of uh, from the card of protection that Madame Eva forecast. The Powerful mm -hmm. force for good and protection, a holy symbol of great hope. There is also a card of strength. The card of power and strength telling of a weapon of vengeance, a sword of sunlight. That's the one. No, we, no, we got the sword of sunlight. of sunlight. No, you haven't received the, recovered the sword of no, sunlight. No, no. no, no. no. Really? My, my, the sword that I got is not it? We're supposed, We're supposed to, go to go in the Amber, Amber Temple, Temple for that. That's where you suppose it, uh, or, or, well, yeah, that's, that's, that's where someone, someone told, told us Lenka. Told us, she, she thinks, thinks it, meant. it meant. Yeah, someone said that that's where they yep, yep. figured that's where it would be. 
because it's guarded by a set of amber door or beyond a set of amber doors. Yeah. Um, 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 will this, will this be, be put in, put in any, any of these compendium things, things or? or no? It's a it's a handout, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. handouts. So you're, okay. you're gonna have to copy it from there, from there yourself. yourself. Or you can pull up the handout whenever you want to use it. Okay. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. Okay. I see, I see it. But I did. But I did add it to my list of, of loot. Loot. Okay. Or, uh, or uh, equipment. equipment. So. So. <coughs> so let's get, so let's get that last weapon. weapon. Yeah, so far, this is the first of the three cards, or the oh, first of the cards yep, yep. that you uh, drew. Uh, you've, you've also got Card of History, Knowledge of the Ancient will help you better understand your enemy. That's where it's located, likely in Berez, Ruins of Berez. Um, card of Strength, which is in the Amber Temple, which you remember also uh, wanting to... Uh, the the Dusk Elf, Casimir, from the uh, uh, Velaki... Vistani encampment. Uh, he said that he was interested in linking up with you guys about that. Uh, in fact, I thought you said you were going to meet him here. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, actually, I think he would be showing up right about now. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> so, yeah, he, he, um, he, I'll have him show up uh, next session and uh, link up with you guys to talk about that if that's what you want to do. Um, so that's the card of strength. Uh, you've also got Strahd's enemy, which the card said, uh, look for an entertaining man with a monkey. Seems more than he seems. That was Rectavio, no, no. or you figured would be Rectavio, but you haven't located him yet, so you're not mm -hmm. sure where he is. So, got a few options ahead of you. Which way did you want to go? I would, I would say, say the Amber Temple. Temple. Yeah, I would, yeah agree. I would agree. Okay. Um, well, why don't we call it here then, uh, and then I can start preparing for that. Um, and we'll say that uh, as you guys are making ready to leave Argenvost, uh, you actually see uh, this lone dusk elf approaching you over the rise. And uh, Rowan would recognize him as Casimir, the leader of the dusk elves from the Vistani encampment. Ninth, 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 ninth level? Ninth level? Um... <laughs> You got an AC bonus and you got a saving throw bonus. I'm gonna hold off on the level bump for now. <laughs> the module's only pretty much scaled for up to ninth level, so <laughs> we're not quite oh, there oh. yet. Can right, so right, we get a rest still? Uh, yeah, you can take a long rest. Recover <clears throat> yeah. uses and everything. And um, man, we're man, supposed, we're to, supposed beat to beat them, them no higher, higher than ninth level. level. Rough. Rough. Well, we're, well pretty, we're pretty, uh, uh we're building our own. That, yeah. that, that's, that's why, why that was, that was a rough fight. That's why, that's why I thought, I'm like, I'm going to try this banishment. I, I, really I really thought he wasn't, I, thought I didn't know how good, good of a chance, chance I had of failing, failing that. He had a plus four. He had a pretty high charisma, but yeah. He, yeah. he rolled low. He rolled like a six. So, so, so <laughs> I'm, I'm glad, glad, that, glad that worked. Yeah, saved, saved, saved our ass. ass. <laughs> pretty much saved everyone's ass. Because these guys, with, when they swore that oath of vengeance against you. Right. Right. That's, that did us in. Yeah, and I mean, we, and we took a lot, a lot more damage from that. Yes. That's an additional 46 of each damage. Yeah. God. Yeah, revenants are nasty. And they had plus, oh, how many hit points do these guys have? This one guy. A lot. A lot. Yeah, it's like 118 <laughs> hit points each, so. Revenants are nasty. <laughs> but now you don't have to worry about them ever again. Pretty much. Yeah. yeah. Well, even well, it sucks if they couldn't have kept them as friends and allies. Friends and allies. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, right? They'd, They'd be useful. useful. They'd, be They'd be very useful. useful. Yeah. yeah, they would be useful as allies. But better to not have them as enemies. <laughs> So you've sure, done a good sure. deed, sirs. Yeah, you've uh, spread light throughout the land. In fact, uh, this is about the closest thing Barovia will ever have to a sun. And, uh, oh, wow. oh, wow. While the light doesn't actually reach uh, Castle Ravenloft, uh, Strahd can look out his castle window and see the light from there at this point. Yeah, yeah and I bet he's pissed. pissed. Yeah. Although, oh, oh, you're not 100% sure, yeah. sure he is in Castle Ravenloft at the moment. 
not sure where he is. He went to Krez for some reason. But in the meantime, uh, so we'll pick up next All time. All right. It's, it's uh, two weeks, I believe, if we're going to keep to our normal schedule. So. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. What day would that be? Let's see. Let's see. That's Sunday. Well, well, yeah. Thursday. Thursday. The 11th. Thursday. Thursday. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thursday the 11th. Yeah. I, I, I should, should, should be able to do that. <laughs> Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. Thanks a lot. Have a good night.